3 auf der Bush Baby Ghetto. And inside is the coals that didn't burn. And really, I'm gonna show you an easy way to clean this kettle fast. 15 minutes and you have a clean kettle. This is under the lid. Look at the coals that didn't burn. Throw them in a bucket and use them on the next barbecue again. Look at that big piece of coal that didn't burn. And really they will work again if you light them up they will burn. Take off the charcoal grill. And get the plastic brush. And on this get to have like 20 millimeter holes. And you brush all the ash down in that holes and they will all fall down into the uh, ash tray under the kettle. And the bigger coals that didn't burn, they will stay behind, you will see in the end when I brush all the ashes into the ash uh, tray, you can see there the coals that didn't burn and left over, we will use them for the next barbecue again. There's the ash tray. Rinse it out with a hose pipe and water. You can see the oil and stuff that stick on the bottom of the kettle. So we just rinse the lid off. And the music is done by me. Then you get hot soapy water, scotch bright, and you just sand the whole kettle with the hot soapy water, and you see everything come loose easy. Just sand and sand and you will see the, the bits and pieces will come loose and then you use the brush to brush the whole kettle. This brush will have to get a fine stuff loose and all that and just take all the stuff and it will come out. Then you rinse it out of the whole spot. And that kettle looks almost like brown. Clean and fresh. 
ready to make your new barbecue dish. And you can scrape this uh, catering inside of this brush. You want the uh, arm the coating on it or nothing like that. You can scrape it to a scotch bright, it won't damage the coating or any soft brush. Then you clean out the lid in the inside. Rinse everything down. And take a dry towel and dry the, the kettle off in the inside, outside, all over. To clean this kettle so easy, taking 15 minutes and it's clean. Now we're gonna take the oven cleaner. This is my scraper and my wire brush. And we're gonna scrape the grill. Take all the pieces of that sitting on it. Spray on the oven cleaner. And this has to stay on the grill for 8 hours because it's, gone, it's working time is 8 hours. But I'm running out of daylight so I will do it tomorrow and clean it further. Here you can see the kettle is clean, nice and ready for the next barbecue. And it look like brand new. And now the kettle is clean, the bottom tray is clean. And just look at the difference, 15 minutes and your kettle is clean. Please like, share and subscribe. Thank you for watching. Goodbye.